Hey guys, my name is James Diaz, and today I'm going to teach you how to play I Miss You by Clean Bandit featuring Julia Michaels on the ukulele. You need a capo on the third fret, and let's get started. The chords for the entire song, except for the pre chorus, is going to be an A minor to a C to an F and then back to a C. So for the entire song except for the pre-chorus. So I'm talking about the first verse, the chorus, and the bridge, and the second verse. It's an A minor, a C, an F, and a C. And the chords for the pre-chorus, the And I know we're not supposed to talk, but I'm getting ahead of myself. It's <clears throat> The chords for that is going to be an F to a G to an A minor and then to a C and then just repeat that F, G, A minor, C F, G, A minor, C so for the entire song it's an A minor a C, an F, and a C and then for the pre-chorus it's an F, a G, an A minor, and a C so what I'll do is I'll play all the different parts of the song for you I'll play the intro, the first verse, the pre-chorus, and the chorus and the bridge just so you can see where these chords are placed in the song and then I'll teach you a basic strumming pattern you could use at the end of the video Alright, so the intro is going to go, uh... A minor to the C, to the F, to the C. Then you go into the first verse and it's... I know you're out in Cabo, hanging with your brother, wishing that I was your bottle, so I could be close to your lips again. I know you didn't tell your parents, and tell them that we ended, cause you know that they'd be offended. Did you not want to tell them that it's the end? Then you go into the pre-chorus, and the pre-chorus goes, And I know we're not supposed to talk, but I'm getting ahead of myself. I'm scared when we're not, cause I'm scared you're somebody else. So I guess that it's gone, and I just keep lying to myself. Oh, I can't believe it. I miss you, yeah, I miss you. I miss you, yeah, I miss you. It's just those same chords, the A minor, the C, the F, and the C. I saved all the texts, all of the best from all of the years, just to remind myself of how good it is. Yeah, I saved all the texts, I love my ex, minus all of the tears, just to remind myself of how good it is. Always, cause I miss you. Then you go back into the chorus, but that's basically where all the chords are placed in the song, so I'll teach you a really simple strumming pattern you could use now. Alright, so a really basic strumming pattern you could use for this song is going to be down, up, up, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, up, up, down, up, up, down, down, up. So it's going to be down, up, up, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, up, up, down, up, up, down, down, up. So down, up, up, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, up, up, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, up, up, down, up, up, down, down, up, down, up, up, down, up, up, down, down, up. Alright, so that's a really basic strumming pattern you could use for this song. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that that helped you. I want to let you guys know about an awesome book called The Girl with the Train by Anthony Eden. These videos are sponsored by this book. It's really, really awesome. I read the whole thing myself. It's on Amazon. It's a really, really good book. It's a post-apocalyptic magnet punk. Like, it's like steampunk, but with magnets. And it's really, really awesome. You guys should check it out. Link in the description below. And uh, if you guys do get it and you like it, I want to ask if you guys could leave a review saying that James Hughes Music sent you, because that would be awesome. And I'll see you guys in another one.